Modern air power hinges on one crucial element, highly skilled pilots. Training these elite aviators demands specialized aircraft, agile, reliable, and packed with cutting edge technology. These aircraft are the crucibles where raw recruits transform into combat ready warriors, mastering the intricate art of flight and aerial warfare. Two such contenders have emerged, vying for the attention of air forces worldwide, the Korean made KIKT-1 Wungbi and the Indian HAL HTT-40. Both aircraft represent the leading edge of basic trainer design, incorporating advanced avionics, robust performance and adaptable training suites. They are designed to bridge the gap between rudimentary flight training and the complexities of high-performance jets. This article delves into the heart of this aerial rivalry, dissecting the design philosophies, technological capabilities and strategic implications of the KT-1 Wungbi and the HTT-40. As nations invest in modernizing their air fleets, the choice of a basic trainer takes on strategic significance. The winner of this competition stands to not only shape pilot training, but also capture a substantial share of the global military aircraft market. Join us as we explore the nuances of this sky-high showdown. Developed by Korea Aerospace Industries, KAI, in partnership with Lockheed Martin, the KT-1 Wungbi, meaning Flying Tiger in Korean, took to the skies in 1998. Designed to replace aging trainers like the T-37 Tweet, the Wung B boasts a tandem seat cockpit configuration, providing optimal visibility for both student and instructor. Powering the Wung B is a single Pratt & Whitney Canada PT-6A-62 turboprop engine, generating 950 shaft horsepower. This robust power plant propels the aircraft to a top speed of 350 knots, 648 kalimiswasos, and grants it a service ceiling of 31,000 feet, 9,450 meters, with a range exceeding 900 nautical miles, 1,665 km. The Wung B offers impressive endurance for extended training sorties. The Wung B's avionics suite is equally impressive featuring a glass cockpit with multifunction displays, a head-up display, HRD, and an upfront control panel, UFCP. These systems, coupled with hands-on throttle and stick, HOTAS controls, provide a simulated modern combat aircraft experience, preparing trainees for the transition to advanced jets. The Hindustan Aeronautics Limited, HL, HTT-40 is India's answer to the growing demand for a homegrown basic trainer. Designed to replace the Hindustan Piston Trainer 32, HPT-32 D-Pack, the HTT-40 boasts a sleek, aerodynamic design optimized for both subsonic and transonic flight regimes. At the heart of the HTT-40 lies a single Honeywell TPE-331 12B turboprop engine delivering 1,100 shaft horsepower. This potent power plant enables the aircraft to achieve a top speed of 450 km per hour, 280 maha, and a service ceiling of 6,000 meters, 19,685 feet. With a range of over 1,000 km, 621 miles, the HTT-40 is well suited for conducting a wide range of training missions. The HTT-40's cockpit is a testament to modern avionics design, featuring a digital glass cockpit with a primary flight display, multifunction displays, and a HUD. Its avionics suite is designed to be reconfigurable, allowing for the simulation of various aircraft types and mission profiles. This article delves into the heart of this aerial rivalry, dissecting the design philosophies technological capabilities and strategic implications of the KT-1 Wungbi and the HTT-40. As nations invest in modernizing their air fleets, the choice of a basic trainer takes on strategic significance. The winner of this competition stands to not only shape pilot training, but also capture a substantial share of the global military aircraft market. Join us as we explore the nuances of this sky-high showdown.